Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Rebuild a World, Rebuild a City, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I've been going through the the rules. I really sat down and looked at them before I began to do this. And I've made, let's just say I've added quite a bit to this challenge. Um, and we'll hurdle that information when we need to but right now I just want to get Anderson up and get him taken care of he needs to clean out the bad food and we need to get her to make some breakfast so let's get her to serve up some pancakes and then we'll get her in here to take care of her needs um, Brayden is fine for right now I'm not gonna really worry about him until it's time and actually you can take care of him. Go ahead and change his diaper. Go ahead and change his outfit. Go ahead and snuggle him. And that should be good. And then we'll have you put Brayden in the high chair. So let's see. We'll have you feed him in his high chair. There we go. Alright. So that's fine. Alright. Phew. Okay, we only have 26 days until winter, which means we've been in this season for two days now. And I just want to go up and look at the town, because it is frosty out. So, I mean, we have such a beautiful view from up here. And we really should take more advantage of it. I can't wait until we can build above land, because being in the ground is just kind of depressing to me. So, yeah. Alright, zooming back in on our folk. <clears throat> so we have to well I have a question for all of you anyone who watches this I want you to go ahead and leave a comment below and I'm going to tell you at the very very end what that comment um, should be and it's kind of going to be like a poll so that next time when we come um, I can tell you what happened so you'll have like a week and I'm going to keep doing this I think it's going to help you guys feel more involved in this LP and I just feel like you guys will like it so um, I'll go into detail a little bit more about it but I do want you guys to remember to leave a comment at the very end of this also Anderson got a wish to have a total of two children he's gonna have to have five but I thought hey why not have a total of two because you know we could definitely get that done all right so you make the pancakes for breakfast while he takes care of the kid that's your job for today take care of the kid feed him no that's not his job I want him to come over and make the bed you can get off your phone that'd be great <laughs> by the way both of their phones are broken yeah that happens it happens all right We look like we have no money because we live in the ground, but we really do have a lot, quite a bit of money, so I don't know. It just kind of stinks. <coughs> and I can hear it storming out, so that's nothing new. Let's put it that way. Nothing new there. All right, let's see. Go here, because when your son is done, which he's done, Go ahead and pick him up. I don't know if he was potty trained or not. I can't remember. So I'm just going to see. Once he picks him up, I'm going to see if he needs a potty trained or not. If not, I'm going to put him down and he's going to go by himself. Let's see. Nope. All right, then put down Brayden here. Brayden, you're going to use the potty chair on your own. I'm going to get you. Grab a plate. You're going to go ahead and grab a plate when you're ready. And then you're going to go ahead and actually, uh, you should kick it up a notch. Grab a plate, put away the leftovers. Alright, so Brayden used his potty chair on his own, which is great. Definitely needs to get that done. <clears throat> and then when he's done using that, he can come over here and play with this. Sorry if you guys hear the squeaking, it's my fan. <clears throat> it's not hot in my house, don't get me wrong, it's freezing in here. But I keep it on my computer just <clears throat> because I was having those issues and now I'm kind of like terrified that it's going to shut down because it's going to overheat. <coughs> though it hasn't done it since I cleaned my computer out so I think I've solved that issue let's hope anyways alright go ahead and clean that up 
You want to catch one more Siamese catfish, but you also want to have another kid. <clears throat> Brayden, how many days do you have until you age up? Four. I think we're going to wait until he has three or two or three. I don't know. One of those two. So let's go out. Actually, I need to go up and let's see. You need to pay the bills first off. Um, but I need to go ahead. I saw it and I don't know why I didn't do this, but I need to accept a friend request from Sims Free Play 3 for the win. Okay. So thank you so much for sending me a friend request and we're friends. All right. Let me put this back on all friends. Cause if it's on that, I'll freak out. Cause I'll be like, Oh my God, where'd all my friends go? But it's not true. It's no big deal. Um, yeah, and I still wish my badges were here, but that's okay. Okay, so go ahead and do that. Um, so what is this up to? Oh, great quality. That's good. It means, um, yeah, I don't know what you're doing. Um, I don't know what I should do. I mean, he's already maxed out, so I could have him garden, which wouldn't be a big deal, and it would keep him here at home. But I don't know what I would have her do because I want her to max out cooking. Well, cooking or gardening, really. So let's not have you garden. Let's not do that. We're going to have him go fishing. And we're just going to let her max out gardening. I know it kind of stinks, but I got to I gotta do this. All right. So let's get you over here. Um, and we're going to get you to go ahead and fish. And we're going to jump over to her, and she's going to go ahead and garden. And I know it stinks that they have to go outside, but we don't have anything else really to do, so this is what we're going to do. Go ahead and tend the garden. All right. <clears throat> and that is fine with me. You guys, you guys are well on your way to success, let me put it that way. You want to cook waffles with perfect ingredients. <clears throat> now, this is what I wanted to look at. Open this up. Waffles, you use an egg. Let's see. And I saw that we could do it, so I wanted to see what do we got. Excellent, excellent, very nice. <coughs> okay. That's fine. What is this? Maui bean. Um, why did she get, like, glitchy and didn't complete it? Hmm. I know this up here has got to be. Oh, you know what? It's probably not because it's dormant. Oh, shoot. That really stinks. So she's only got one plant now. Oh, man. All right, let's see. <clears throat> let's take the Maui beans and sell them. All right, there we go. She needs some social. So let's get her to play with um, play with Brayden. I think that'll give her social. I'm not sure, so I'm going to sit here and wait. <clears throat> I think this is going to glitch. I don't know. It's going to be really weird. She's, like, sitting literally on him. Yeah, this is a little this is a little weird. But it does give her social and it does give her fun, so I don't really have <laughs> that looks awkward. But it's just a little glitch that happens sometimes. Alright, you're gonna go ahead and stand out here in the rain and fish. <coughs> All I want him to catch is one more Siamese catfish so we can be done with fishing for a while. But he hasn't done it yet. Not yet. We're getting closer. <coughs> Alright, how many fish have you caught? Just that one? Okay. Well, I really want the kissing, or the kissing, I really want the Siamese catfish more than anything. But I guess any fish he catches are fine because we do need, um, oh wow. We do need uh, money and food for the fridge, so I guess it's fine. That's a minnow. Oh, God. He did not like that one. Yeah, so she's much better now that we had her sit down and play with him. So that's good. You want to prepare a special recipe at home. But you have to grow three outstanding fruits or vegetables. And we keep selling them. We're horrible at this. <laughs> 
Well, I'm horrible at this. All right. Brayden, are you done with that toy yet? It didn't tell me, so I'm going to have to say probably not. All right. It doesn't seem like you watered this plant, so you should really take care of it. He caught a goldfish. Okay. All right, let's see. Open this up. Let's see. Goldfish, minnow, and the kissing fish. Where are they all? I think that's the kissing one. So we can sell this for 64. The goldfish is at 10, so we can sell this one for 20. <clears throat> and the minnows are at 10, so we can sell this one for 11. And the... <coughs> The red herrings are at 10, so we can sell this one for 5. And the reason I do 10 is because it's a pretty good number, and it's even. So, it's like 2 pluses to me. Alright, this one we can sell for 77. Alright, are you full? Well, not on fun yet, so I'll just keep letting you go. <coughs> I don't know if her playing with him makes it go any faster or not. I don't know. But that's okay. Okay. I think she can stop now. <laughs> He can keep playing by himself. He doesn't need her to be there. <coughs> Sorry, my throat feels really dry. Just like all of a sudden, too, because I was just fine a minute ago. <coughs> Alright, so let's see. Oh, he's finished his peg box. Then you can stop with that, and you can play with the xylophone. You want to master your gardening skill? Okay, you can clean that. That's fine. Actually, we could just click for you to clean the whole house. <clears throat> and that way, whatever needs to be cleaned, you'll clean. Also, there's only autumn salad and apple pancakes. So I was thinking we could serve up something <clears throat> maybe for dinner. It's not dinner time yet. And what we have options for lunch, well, they don't, they, you have to pay for them. And we can't pay for food. So that's the sad thing. All right, can you empty this? That'd be great if you could do that. <clears throat> what do you got in here? All right, we're selling this for five, selling this for 19. I know he's soaked and I know he's cold, but he'll be okay for right now. <coughs> All right. So, you only know two people. You know... Uh, four people and you know three people all right it's kind of funny how the kid knows more than it's his parent his mom does it's just kind of weird <clears throat> anyways i want you to dispose of all the dead plants because that's something that needs to be done as well oh i thought he caught a siamese catfish at first when i read that i get really excited but it's a rainbow trout and we're gonna sell it oh wait let's check and see if we can use it downstairs <coughs> nope we're full on them so we'll sell it for 19 simoleons all right yeah go ahead and get rid of the dead plants we don't need those they're just a hassle <coughs> all right he is only getting chilly still so i'm not too worried yet I want her to get that in there. So I'm going to get rid of Eat at the Bistro and put this in instead. <coughs> Alright, is there anything else? Whoops. Is there anything else you need to do with your garden? Well, you could weed the plants at least. And do any of them need to be watered? Probably not because it's already raining. So we'll at least get her to, to weed them. Maybe that'll help. <coughs> I kind of wish I had chosen something with um, gardening now because we've pushed her more on gardening than we have on cooking. 
And now we're like kind of at a standstill with her because I'm not like, I want her to get the cooking skill, but we're so much closer on gardening that it'll probably happen faster than getting all the cooking done. So I don't know. Whichever one we get done, it's fine. All right, so you're doing fishing. Okay. And you're working on the xylophone, which, to be honest, <clears throat> since he's done with this for right now, I'm just going to put it in our inventory. And let's see. <clears throat> this we're never going to use, so I'm going to sell it. We can't have decorations, so I'm going to sell those. This light, I would love to use this light, but we can only have a candle, so I'm going to get rid of that. <clears throat> this bed I'm going to keep. We're not going to university, so I'm going to sell that. So we just have this couple of stuff. <coughs> there we go. <coughs> Man, I have not coughed in like the last four or five hours. Now all of a sudden, it's like cough galore. Wow, it got dark up here. I do need to put some lights out here or something. Oh, there we go. I was starting to wonder there for a second if we were going to be able to see or not. All right, he's still fishing. Oh, he finally caught one. Yay! All right, rainbow trout. All right, you want to warm up. Then get home. We're done with fishing for right now. All right, let's see if we have to put this in downstairs or not. It is a Siamese catfish. Where is it? Oh, yeah, we could use one. So I'll go ahead and put that in there. There we go. He wants to warm up, and he wants to have another kid. So, looks like we're going to be trying for another kid. All right. I'm so excited he finally got that done. Man, I've been trying forever to get him to complete that. Brayden is becoming a music musician because he's working on the xylophone. When he's ready, he needs to go use the potty. She's just weeding plants, so nothing big's happening with her. Nothing too big, anyways. <clears throat> Where are you at? <coughs> I thought I heard him. That means somebody's probably at our house. And I have no idea who it is. Always the good times. All right, who was it? Oh, it's this person. Well, that's nice. Oh, yeah, we got chickens. I totally forgot we got the chickens. Oh, my goodness. All right. Let's go ahead and harvest eggs, feed the chickens. Go ahead and take care of that. I would be so mad at myself if I forgot to harvest those eggs. Because she wants to make the pancakes or the waffles with the perfect ingredients. Oh, I would be so mad. Alright, let's see. What did we get? Outstanding, great, and nice. Okay, good. Alright, I think it's time to go inside. So let's go ahead and get her to stop. Well, I'll let her finish that and then... She can go here. Whoops, wrong child person. She can go here by running. And I'm going to get him to go in here. And I'm going to put these in the refrigerator. Just because I can. All right. <clears throat> All right, stop weeding. Let's get you to use this. All right. We're going to get you to use this when he's done. All right, then you can go here. <coughs> and I'm going to get them to woohoo in the shower in just a second. I just want to let her go to the bathroom first so we can get it all taken care of. No, go here. <coughs> All right. Um, no, thank you. Let's go ahead and try for a baby with Demarius. We're just going to see if it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But if it does, it does. <clears throat> oh, he warmed up. Okay. Okay, seriously? You have to wash your darned hands? Okay, we don't really want to wash our hands, so let's go. So he wants to have a girl, he wants to have two kids, and he wants to have a child. Those are pretty much all his wishes is to have babies. 
So if we can have a girl, we could get rid of all of this. Oh, you little son of a gun. All right, well, she's being hard to get again. All right, Amorous Hug. It has to be protected. Um, compliment her appearance. Dip kiss her. Flirt with her. Flirtatious joke. Heat of the moment kiss. Hold hands. Kiss her. Um, shy kiss her. Whoops. Make a promise to protect her. Their relationship hasn't even dropped, and she's just being really hard. Mm. Embrace her. Hold her hands. Scoreful. All right, hold her hands. Make out with her. Make out. Okay, let's see. <coughs> Go ahead and embrace. Alright, embrace. Um, stroke her cheek. Uh, whisper in her ear. And then try for a baby with her. Child, go to the bathroom. All right, he's only got one more level here, so that's really good. And when he's done, he can use come back over here and play with this a little bit more until they can feed him at least. <clears throat> and then we'll be good. Yeah, don't pee yourself. I mean it. Um, <laughs> you're just glitching all over the place. All right, so when you're done, you can come over and play with this again so that your parents can have a peaceful, peaceful woohoo. What do you want to do with him? You want to snuggle him? We can definitely do that. <clears throat> we don't have a perfect egg yet, but we'll get there. I promise you. All right, let's get in there and try for a baby. Whoa, that was a glitch and a half. <laughs> All right, little kid, get out of the bathroom. They'll take care of you right after they're done. They're trying for a little sister for you. How do you feel? Are you excited? I'm excited. <laughs> All right. All right. He's certain that she'll be a great mother, and he's deciding to have a baby with her. All right. Perfect. Let's go ahead and get in the shower, folks. Oh, goodness gracious. If you don't do it here, I'm going to make you do it on the bed. So either or, you're going to get it done. Do I have to make you do it on the bed? <clears throat> Come on. Oh, God. All right. More. What the Fs? Dip kiss her. Do not even start with me. <clears throat> They're making me angry. All right. Make out with her. Then go ahead and try for a baby. <coughs> okay. Come on. Do this properly now. Do it properly. Marius thinks Anderson is being extremely irresistible. Okay, come on, guys. They're going to do it on the bed. I guess that's where they'd rather. Well, you know what? Then get in here and get her done. And you have a good relationship with your son. You have a good relationship with your son. That's great. Means we're doing something right. Okay. 
I'm just listening for the chimes just to hear see if I hear them, but I haven't heard them yet. Well, it's not time for them yet either. So let's see. There they are. Okay. So you know what? I'm going to get you to feed this child in the high chair. And I'm going to get you to eat. Oh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. All right, you're not sleeping. You're going to get up and feed him in the high chair. You're not sleeping. You're going to get up and serve some dinner. And you're going to serve up some veggie rolls. She enjoyed a woohoo with him. All right, I'll go ahead and share it just, you know, to have the little fun. Yeah, you guys may be tired and all, but you're not going to bed yet. you got a child that needs hung food and sleep, social, a little bit of hygiene. You guys got to take care of your kids first. All right, so you know what? Yeah, let's let your dad feed you. Feed him in the high chair. Well, listen to me, and then you'll get food. Oh, goodness gracious. Go here. You, feed him in the high chair. Oh, my goodness. Go here. You go here. All right. Now, feed him in the high chair. It's like they like can't figure it out. Oh, man. <clears throat> All right. So feed him in the high chair so he's not hungry and starving to death and in the orange. Normally I'm really good about taking care of my kids, but for some reason I'm having a hard time with the toddlers lately. It's just horrible. I shouldn't be. All right, go ahead and use this. Go ahead and take a shower. Are you kicking it up a notch? Yes, you are. All right, go ahead and grab a plate. When you're done, you can go ahead and, um, you know what? You can go ahead and snuggle your son like you want to do. And then you can put Brayden to bed. Then you can grab a plate and put away the leftovers. And I'm going to let her go to bed early tonight because normally, <coughs> normally he goes to bed first. <coughs> so at least this time we won't have that issue well we won't have him going to bed at least he'll take care of the baby alright Brayden you're not making life any easier by screaming constantly I can tell you that one alright go here All right, and you can go ahead and sleep. <coughs> Snuggle that child, and then let's get him to bed. <coughs> All right. It is almost 1 o'clock in the morning. He's probably exhausted. Poor thing. She snores really loud. All right, Anderson. Put that poor child to bed. He's tired. Very tired. <coughs> he could have used hygiene and bladder, but he can do that in the morning, too. It's not that big of a deal. We're just going to follow Anderson <coughs> as hopefully that child falls asleep. A liquid job booster. Yeah, we don't need that yet. <coughs> not yet, anyways. All right, so you eat your sushi. And then put your, or you eat your veggie rolls, and then you put your veggie rolls in the fridge. Actually, I wanted to see, could she have made sushi? Oh, it's breakfast time. <coughs> she needs a counter, okay. That's fine. All right, go ahead and use this, and go ahead and take a shower. Go ahead and empty this. <coughs> you ain't going to bed until you clean that up now. I thought you'd do it on your own, but I guess not. All right. So, Brayden, you're fine. Damaris, you're fine. Anderson, you're going to be fine once you climb into bed <coughs> at, like, 2 o'clock in the morning. It's actually going to be later than 2, probably. Let's see. Oh, yeah, after 2. 
Uh, probably more like 203. Yep, 203. All right, guys, so I'm going to come right back when someone's getting up, and I'll be back in just one second. All right, so Demarius is getting up, and it's about 8.30 in the morning. So as you guys saw, oh, she's getting sick. You probably already know why. But um, I, as you saw, I had her using the bathroom facilities and emptying out the potty. When she's done with that, Brayden's almost done sleeping. So what I'm going to have her do is just I'm just going to have her take care of him. Um, no, actually, clean out the bad food. What's bad? Oh, the autumn salad. Go ahead and eat the pancakes. And then let's have you change his diaper. And change his outfit to his everyday. Go ahead and snuggle him. <clears throat> and then go ahead and feed him in the high chair. <clears throat> Anderson, when you get up, I want you to go ahead and make the bed. Then you can use the bathroom facilities. And then you may eat, no, not clean all the bad food. You may eat the apple pancakes. And then we'll figure out what he's going to do for the day as well. Because, obviously, he doesn't have any fishing wishes. And I'm not sure we really need to fish anymore. <clears throat> so, I'm not sure what I'm going to have him do quite yet, anyways. For right now, I'm not too worried about it. Alright, Demarius, since you're the only one up, I'm going to kind of fast forward through your taking a shower and all that kind of jazzy stuff. So, because that's just that's not what I like to watch. <clears throat> yeah, it's... You get cold from that shower because it is pretty um, cheap, if you want to say. So, all right. Well, don't eat then until you take care of your son, at least. I did hear him wake up. I knew it. Yeah, get, those, get that food out of there. That'll be good. And then let's get him taken care of. And I did tell you to feed him. Yeah, I did. Okay. I want to make sure I told her to feed him in the high chair. All right, so I'll slow you down just a little bit. All right, Anderson, you should be getting up any second. Yeah, they don't really like that shower, but there's nothing I can really do. It says it has to be the cheapest shower, so that kind of stinks, but... If that's what I got to do, that's what I got to do. All right, go ahead and feed this child. And then you can go ahead and eat apple pancakes. You want to play in the ocean with Brayden? How cold is it? 42? I know the kids don't get cold, but that would just seem really cold to take your kid down there and play with him in the ocean at that degree. So, I don't know. Well, anyways, you got to let him out after you're done eating because he's going to be done eating and he needs to use the bathroom. So we'll at least get him to do that. <clears throat> for right now, I'll lock it in just so we have it, but I don't know if we're going to do it or not. It just seems really cold to take your kid down to play in the ocean. That's just my opinion, but I don't know. All right, so... Marius, let him out, and then I'm going to get you to come over here and tend to your garden, and since she's going to let you out, I'm going to have you use the potty, and then you can come over here and play with your toy. <coughs> Alright, buddy, you're freaking out about nothing. And oh, I was going to turn off, I was going to ignore that call, but I guess it already stopped ringing, so... <clears throat> Alright, go ahead and clean up your plate. I feel like every time I tell him to clean up his plate, he already is going to do it. So, it's like a waste of my time. But then if I don't tell him to do it, then he doesn't choose to do it on his own. Oh, can never win. Alright. See? Oh no, he's going to put it down. Okay. Um... All right, so you're done. No, you're not going to view that. You're done with that. So let's get you up here to take care of these plants. And you know what? Let's take care of this one. Oh, dispose of all the dead plants. 
And then let's get you to weed the plants because that really needs to be done as well. And I guess we could have you take them down there to play in the ocean. I don't really see a problem, like, I guess, but it just seems kind of silly. So let's get you to pick up Brayden. And then let's get you to go here with him. And while you're doing that, I'm going to tell you to go here with Brayden. And we're going to follow you, I guess. We're going to quickly let you play with him in the ocean, then you're going to bring him home because he's going to get really cold, probably. And he's probably not going to like this very much. <clears throat> I don't know if in the fall time I would be going in the cold water, but hey. Who knows? Especially if it was only like... Whew, excuse me, I had to yawn. Um, if it was like 25 days before like winter time, I don't know about that one. That's like November. <laughs> I don't think I would be in the ocean in November, but... It may be different because the ocean should be warm. How warm is it out? Um, 37. Right about now, I would die for 37 degree weather. But that's not the kind of weather that I would be going in the ocean in. So that's just that's just a quick little tidbit about myself. All right. So while while we're kind of just walking down here, um, the thing that I want you guys to leave a comment about is Anderson obviously has already maxed out his fishing skill. Well, there's a couple of places that. We could use that cooking skill, or cooking, that fishing skill towards. And I want you to choose one of the buildings that I'm going to mention that you would need it for. So the, and it will be like the first place that will build for them in the town. But there's going to be a lot of other requirements to go with it. So that's why it's kind of, I'm kind of going to let you guys choose. And then in a way, you guys are choosing like what buildings come first. And then like I can choose, I'll choose to build them and things like that. So let's see. Why can we not play in the ocean with the child? Is this going to tell me it's not the ocean? Because this is definitely the ocean. No. Swim, skip stone, snorkel, fish. Oh gosh. Alright, play in the ocean with Brayden. Go ahead. <coughs> what is the matter with you? All right, so you need a more flat surface, maybe. Well, let's see how flat this is. I don't know if it gets much flatter. But maybe right here, play in the ocean with Brayden. All right, go here. Oh, wait, maybe he's going. No, I don't think he is. What's this thing? I don't know. If we can't get this, I'll just exit out. All right, let's see. Oh, it doesn't let you play there. Play in the ocean with Brayden. Go here. All right, <clears throat> back to this. Hold on a second. I'm just trying to make sure he gets this done. I think we tried to do this before and we couldn't figure it out. Play in the ocean with Brayden. All right, he cannot play here. Try playing on the coastline that's more shallow. Well, where am I going to find a coastline that's more shallow? Because that's not. This definitely isn't. All right, let's see. More shallow coastline. Is that like over here, maybe? Um, I don't think so, but maybe. So let's see, can you play in the ocean with Brayden here? No. I don't know. I really don't. So, I'm just going to send them home because I have no idea how to do that. And it's pouring down rain on them, so I'm sure that the baby's not very happy. Alright, well while he's walking, let me just tell you the certain places that you guys can choose from. So these are the places that are going to need the fishing scale to be built and placed into the town. So the first one 
is, and what I want you to do is write down the name. So there's either the bistro, or we could use it towards getting a diner. The diner only requires a level 5 of fishing, and the bistro requires a level 10. Um, then the next place would be the supermarket, which we could use to buy like food and stuff. Um, the next one would be the bookstore. The reason I chose it for there is because any kind of skill book that you can buy there, obviously somebody has to know what they're doing to be able to write that book. So I was thinking, well, you know, like, um, obviously you're going to need to know that skill to be able to get that book in there. So I thought fishing for there. Uh, the next one would be the pool. I don't really know why you'd need fishing for the pool, but I guess because you can fish in it, I guess. Um, the next one would be a gym. We could make or put his fishing skill to the mm, science facility. Um, or the hospital. And I don't know if there's any more, so let me just see. Um, uh, no, I think that's it. So those are the places. So it, again, it was the bistro, the diner. Um, I would think a park because wouldn't you think like um, a park would have like a pond in it with fish? I don't know. Maybe not. Um, the supermarket, the bookstore the pool, the gym, um, and the last one, I believe, was the science facility. Oh, no, and then the hospital. So choose one of those and just write it in the comments below, and then we'll put his credit of his fishing skill towards that building. But it can only go towards that one building, which is why I'm saying, like, you guys can choose, because the thing is, is... All right, let me explain this before my time, and I only got, like, two minutes. I was going back through these, and it was saying how, like, every single one of these is going to have to be... It says that um, each sim can only use their max skill to build one building. So, like, once he uses his fishing for that building, no one else will have to max it for that, but they'll have to max it for another building. Like, if we chose the diner, then somebody else would have to max their fishing skill for the bistro. So it would make it a bit more dynamic and harder to achieve. So I thought that would be kind of cool. And um, so when she maxes, either if she maxes the gardening or the cooking, we'll put it towards the building that she wants. But not only do we have to get it this way, then if we chose like um, a diner, I think over here, on the other set of rules, the diner has like its own set of rules, so we would have to complete those as well. <clears throat> but that's totally different. No, I don't actually, I think these are just jobs. Mm, yeah. So once we got all the requirements to build the lot, then we could look into people getting the job. So if you guys like this idea, please don't forget to leave your comment below of what you would like to see his fishing skill go towards. What are you doing? Did you finish your garden already? Oh, I forgot to... Ugh. hate when I do that. And then let's get you to play with the chicks. The reason I'm making her do it so many times is so the chicks will get out of here. Alright, put down Brayden. Brayden, I want you to play with this. What's wrong with you? And then I'm going to get him to play with his son just because today is a day that they spend together. Oh, you're going to do it by yourself. Look at you go. All right. So that's what I'm thinking. And when you guys leave me the comment, I will make sure to add that. If you guys are wondering about my rules, um, I could write them all up for you if you really wanted me to. I'm going to make them more updated so they're not quite done yet because I want to do like all the supernatural lots and everything like that isn't added in here yet um, or doesn't have both sets of requirements. So if you guys like my rules, 
just let me know. Please leave a comment below of um, what you guys want to see his fishing skill go towards the first building that we'll build for that. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.